Hey Turtle Nerds, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're gonna go over a little bit of an update on the whole fake barnacle sea turtle rescue thing. If you guys don't know what's going on, essentially these people in Eastern countries, be it Malaysia, Vietnam, Egypt, wherever they may be, non-Western countries, they're taking freshwater species of turtles, gluing barnacles to their shells, and then scraping them off and pretending to find them and calling them sea turtles, or ASMR basically. And it's no bueno because turtles have nerves in their shells the same way that you can feel stuff on your fingernails, and it's extremely uncomfortable, especially for the soft shells or the fly river turtles that have soft shells. But wait, there's more. They're reusing the same turtles, like most of the time. So the main offender, the channel was Ocean Sea. Right before his channel got shut down, he started jumping ship over to a different channel called Vast Ocean, which as of today, it has been terminated. We friggin' did it. I cannot believe the power that we collectively hold, guys, because this was all on you guys. Oh, Gilbert's coming through. Suck my tiny turtle nuts, Ocean Sea. <sighs> Sorry. Anyways, uh, yeah, check it out. As of this morning, the channel was terminated. I got an email from some people. A ton of people started commenting. Good job, big gold star to everyone that helped report the channel. Now, as a disclaimer, so I don't get demonetized or taken down or my video terminated or my channel terminated or YouTube comes and chops my head off. This is not targeted harassment. This is not bullying. I do not condone if you go and report all these channels and get their uh, things taken down. Green, green, wink, wink, nudge, nudge. So today we're gonna take a look at some other channels that are doing the same thing and talk about the shtick. In the original video, I said copycats were gonna come up. Essentially what they've done is they've downloaded all of the videos from Ocean Sea, Vast Ocean, whatever those those jerks are called and they have re-uploaded in different forms. So this channel has 70,000 subscribers and what they've done is they're just compiling rescue videos of actual sea turtles intermittently with ones that are not legitimate or they're even doing it with look baby sea cow that's a manatee here's one with it with a horseshoe crab where they're doing the same type of thing here's a rescue of a sea lion it's because it's fitting into that appealing to western audiences of these like fake rescues so here's one channel save pause and to cover a frequently asked question which was i can't see the report button on mobile you can't see the report button until after you watch the ads and after youtube gets their money that's also why they were so slow to demonetize and take down these channels and Thanos snapped and demonetized my video. A very nice woman named Anne Reardon of How to Cook That did a, a nice video on the dangers of fractal wood burning, it's called. Essentially where you do some type of electric mumbo jumbo and it burns like cool patterns through the wood, except dozens of people have died from it. So she did a video exposing those arts and crafts things that are the videos that are actually really dangerous. Same type of niche as rescue videos a little bit. And her video got taken down. Thankfully it's been reinstated since, but that's why my first video got demonetized. And I don't care about the monetization for the people that say I do. I mean, of course, it can't help. I got turtles to feed. But it's because the views just stopped. They freaking plateaued. And that's why I'm also making this video to expose more people because it seems like the people that are normally getting recommended those videos of the fake sea turtle rescues are also getting recommended my videos. So then they're learning. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna keep this going. Anyways, this is a very common problem on YouTube because they get their chunk of change too. So anyways, uh, back to my original point, you're better off reporting on desktop or something like that. That way you can mass report all the videos if you're going to. Not that I condone that. Some people ask me, oh, why doesn't PETA get involved? They've tried to get in contact with YouTube about this being an issue. Crickets. Dead silence. YouTube is not answering uh, because they don't want to deal with the legal battle. Save pause. BS. They're just compiling stuff from the internet. Here's a fun channel. Rescue Turtle. Thankfully, the rest of these channels are small, but we're still going to go over it and talk about some different things about fake videos on the internet. They're just re-uploading Ocean Seas old videos as well. Here we can see one. There's another. I'm not going to actually show the scraping and whatnot because I don't want to get demonetized. Here we go through. They're doing the same thing, but what I found interesting was that not only are they uploading multiple of the same video, when I was going through just clicking on some of the videos at random, watch this. I'm Kyle Snow from the Washington Wild wildlife refuge and a sea rescue volunteer they're putting text to speech audio pretending to be some western dude some guy from america in washington part of a, a washington sea turtle rescue we've created a channel rescue turtle to learn you how to help a turtle get rid of once and for all while you're on the beach or deep in the sea so they're, they're justifying what they're doing to try to retroactively or proactively stop 
people from commenting and saying this is fake or stop them. Oh, if you had any doubts, it's me, Kyle Snow. I'm a robot, like Mark Zucker. Actually, Mark's a lizard, but this guy, he's a robot. Not only that, the best part is that they're putting this audio over, this is not just a freshwater turtle. They didn't even pretend to find this thing in the ocean. This is in the middle of a forest and that's a Malaysian snail eating turtle. You dumb dumb. Rescue turtle, you're next buddy. Because that audio, this text to speech was made by, by him. Very clever. Good idea, not getting away with it. I hope that you support the channel and share it with your friends and do not skimp on us with your comments. Guys, don't skimp on them comments. Drop them, right? You guys gotta support us. Look what we're doing. We're ripping content from the internet, faking, gluing barnacles to turtles, even freshwater species, even species that aren't even found anywhere near the ocean. And then we're asking you to help support and push our content because clearly we're not doing well because we have 60 subscribers. Buddy, uh-uh, not today. And directions that make us proud. Now we leave you with a giblet and a summary of does removing barnacles harm or help sea turtles. So they go over, uh, first of all, I love that they say giblet because when I think giblet, I think of a turd, which is exactly what I'm watching. The problem is that the, the information that they're giving is correct, but then they're showing a Malaysian snail eating turtle and those aren't even barnacles. Living things, algae, barnacles, sometimes hydroids, etc. Graped, etc. If the turtle is healthy, this will not increase to a level that interferes with or otherwise hurts the turtle. This is correct information. They're pulling correct information and overlaying it with their fake rescue, asking for support. It's BS. We've created a channel rescue turtle to learn you how to help a turtle get rid of once and for all while you're on the beach or deep in the sea. They're reusing the same videos also, the same text to speech, the same garbage, Malaysian snail eating turtle, same crap. Oh, look, 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 the video was only four minutes. So in order to extend it to over eight and a half minutes, that way you could put mid-roll ads, they just leave a black screen at the end of the video. Great job. Nothing says I want money and content like that. Do you like turtles? Do you not want these turtles to starve? Then become a member on my Patreon today. Patrons get access to all kinds of exclusive content, including behind the scenes photos, bonus videos, turtles when I have them available, and so much more. Direct message me with all of your turtle related questions and I'll walk you through how best to care for your turtle or just come say hi. Join my Patreon today and get access to over 300 bonus content posts. The reason I don't link to the channels directly is because I'm not targeting or harassing these people. And then the fun thing is that they uploaded this video. Now this is actually a sea turtle. You could see the flippers and the colors and whatnot. That is, you know, those fins are definitely from a sea turtle, except it's not alive. This is a dead sea turtle. And I've been seeing that increase a whole lot too, to the point where they're taking the freshwater turtles. I saw a readier slider and the person's like massaging it for ASMR and like pulling stuff off of it. It was dead. I can't show that because it's graphic. I'm actually getting off this video because it's graphic. And then here's, of course, the classic. This is a yellow belly slider with fake barnacles glued to it. They just put up their watermark too, even though they stole this video. Here's another one just called Ocean. Thankfully, the most views that they have is like 20,000 views. Is that a dead sea turtle? Oh, this is the original video. I told you, they're ripped. They're just ripping it from wherever and putting on their watermark. Here, Ocean, this video Ocean did the same thing. The other people, I guess they flipped it or these guys flipped it. Very clever to avoid copyright strikes. Again, this is a dead sea turtle because it's not fighting back it's not even trying an actual sea turtle would be freaking out there's another one planet and me you know you just type in sea turtle barnacle rescue and you go to the most recent videos and you'll find all kinds of these channels here's another guy animals lovers this is another malaysian snail eating turtle they didn't they're not even trying anymore like this is so clearly a freshwater pond another malaysian snail eating turtle how is it getting barnacles? Let's keep going. This animal's lovers, he's trying to upload shorts, just anything to get the algorithm to pick up the video and roll with it. And the thumbnails. The thumbnails kill me because they're always fake. And, and even though this guy's showing a Malaysian snail eating turtle in the thumbnail here, when you, when you, you, when you actually click on the video, it's a map turtle from Ocean Sea. That it's their content that they just ripped, and now Ocean Sea can't copyright claim it because their their channel went bye bye. Thankfully, these guys aren't making money on on these videos yet, but they're trying to very clearly. Again, these are snails glued to a freshwater turtle, and you can tell it's in fresh water. These guys aren't even anywhere near a beach, so they had to improvise. Look, there's lily pads around them. No, no, fr there's no parasitic species of snail or barnacle that impacts this heavily. Then they're doing it, people are doing this stuff with other animals. 
I know that we talked about kittens. I know that we talked about the dog rescue, the fake dog rescues. Anything that has a million, someone said search million rescue on YouTube, million tears monkey rescue. There are these channels that are just have tortured monkeys. Straight up torture. What? How is this still up? How is this still a thing? You, again, I said YouTube just does not care because they're still getting their cut of revenue. They don't want any legal claim or any legal battle. Look, this dude's strangling the freaking monkey in the thumbnail. I mean, it's sick. The rabbit hole goes so deep. I know that other content creators have made videos on stuff like this, but I just can't freaking believe it. Hi guys, I'm editing. I'm in the middle of editing the video. Here it is, here's the video I'm editing. Um, the monkey thing's worse than I thought. I don't know how these baby monkeys get in this situation. They're macaques as well, sorry. It's probably faked, but I don't know, I can't say for certain. But the comments are the most concerning thing I have ever seen. People are getting some sick rise, like people that don't like kids or don't want kids are getting some sick enjoyment out of the monkeys, out of the macaques being dead. I wish I was making this up, Look at some of these comments. I'm not gonna show the actual video because it literally shows a dead baby monkey. Amazing video, entertaining all the way through. It's a gem. And then who knew they could be so quiet? I'm like, okay, like maybe these people are just kind of weird. No tears here, just give me that food. I mean, it's a monkey. What do you expect? Those baby, wow, those babies are nice and quiet. How lovely not to hear the screeching entitlement. Entitled? How? It's freaking two months old. Isn't it? They are so well-mannered, not climbing all over mom, not throwing a tantrum for the milk taps. Ah, heartwarming. Heartwarming, she says. The dead baby monkey is heartwarming. And they always use the word spawns. This is really freaking weird. I'm gonna have to make a separate video on this because I didn't realize it was this bad till just now. All macaques spawn should strive to emulate the exemplary behavior of these macrap spawns. What? Such a wonderful heartwarming video. The screaming demons are so quiet, well-behaved, just adorable. I agree with you 100%. No screeching, no entitled spawns throwing tantrums. Bro, what is this weird, misguided, uh, emotional upset at kids? Four upvotes on this, so four people agree. Finally, I just wish they would have got its last breath on camera, damn it. Dead tree rat babies attract flies and bugs, free food for the mother. I just figured I would go over this because this is weird. This is a weird rabbit hole that I'm not getting into yet. I don't know. Back to regularly scheduled program. I have no words, like actual. I can't. You know, just be skeptical, be on the lookout, be aware of everything like this. I tried doing a video reacting to turtles in popular media. I put a lot of effort into it and I really enjoyed it and I think you guys will too. So please consider hitting the link right up over here and checking that out. Thank you to my patrons for making today's video possible and uh, I will see you all in the next one.